Today represents the best the diesel industry has to offer, which is the newest generation of near zero emissions clean engines from everything in passenger cars all the way up to the biggest off-road machines and equipment. Uh, today is all about celebrating the progress and the transformation of clean diesel over the last decade here in California, really and around the nation. Today is really a celebration. It's a celebration of near zero emissions and a collaboration between industry and the resources board. Well, the thing is, it's, uh, with diesel technology, it's a constant evolution, and we get to show, showcase the uh, clean energy, the clean diesel technology that has come a long way in the last 15 or 20 years. Uh, it's something we're very proud of in the industry. Uh, it allows us to show off our technology, uh, show off the research efforts that have been put forth uh, to uh, clean up the emissions uh, with regard to diesel technology. The clean engines in these trucks and the other machines on, on the street today are the result of a collaborative effort between ARB, EPA, and the diesel engine and vehicle industries. The, the key has been two things. Number one is competition, and number two is, has been the regulations. Regulations will tend to drive technology, and technology, we can take that and adapt that into improving the fuel economy for the customer while cleaning the exhaust emissions. So this is, this is a good, it's a partnership between the government and the commercial industry. This has been a 20-year journey for industry, and it's been an exciting one. And it's an awful lot of hard work, a lot of money, a lot of people's careers, a lot of technology, and all focused on customer value and near zero emissions. 20 years ago, if you would have told me that we, were, we would be where we are today with a diesel engine that's near zero emissions, I would have told you you're crazy. And it is a wonderful time for the industry as a whole, that we've embraced the technology to get to where we are today. We'll see a continued uh, reduction in our emissions levels. Uh, we will see more of a focus on greenhouse gas emissions. Uh, and that goes hand in hand with the efficiency of the engines. It's 90% cleaner than it was before. We get better fuel economy than we did 20 years ago. And we've got about 8 to 10,000 pounds more freight that we haul on the same vehicle. What you see here today are products that we have developed that meet the most stringent emissions regulations in the world and deliver the value that our customers expect every day. So diesel power has become the dominant uh, source of power for all the commercial vehicles in the United States today. Um, and it's because of its durability, its fuel efficiency, its performance, uh, all of those things that add up to make it the best commercial choice for our customers. The last 10 years have been all about making diesel clean, getting it to near zero emissions for nitrogen oxides and PM. The next 10 years are going to be all about furthering the energy efficiency of diesel. A lot of the work that we've done here has really been to highlight uh, the good technology development and product development that our member companies have done, but really just weren't getting credit for it. And people did not realize that we could have a diesel engine that had no visible emissions, that had virtually no particulate emissions. The Diesel Technology Forum has really been an important instrument for us in conveying the message to the public that diesel technology really has changed. 